Thank you, Madam Chair. I first want to express my gratitude to you and Vice Chair Collins. It's a testament to your tremendous leadership and determination um, from both of you that today marks a milestone of this committee marking up 12 out of 12 appropriations bills. It's a significant accomplishment and no doubt a win for the American people that the appropriations process is proceeding in this fashion and that would not happen without the leadership of the two of you. On a personal note, especially as a freshman member, I have greatly appreciated your counsel and support over these last few months. And ranking member Collins, I remain honored and humbled by the responsibility with which you entrusted me and your earlier shout out. Thank you. I also appreciate the comments of my colleague, Chairman Murphy, about the positive nature of our engagements on the Homeland Security Bill. I have enjoyed working with him from the very beginning, even into the final minutes before this vote. In particular, I'd like to highlight some of the important provisions this bill, that are in this bill that I believe will improve border security and protect our nation. I am pleased that this bill funds an increase of more than 1,100 personnel across Customs and Border Protection and Immigration Customs Enforcement. It also includes significant funding for border security technology. In addition, fentanyl is the leading cause of death, as you all know, in America between our citizens the ages of 18 to 45. And this bill appropriates over $800 million in new funding to combat the scourge of fentanyl that is poisoning our communities, schools, families, and destroying too many American lives. This bill is a positive step forward in a whole of government approach to target the cartels and transnational criminal organizations engaged in fentanyl trafficking, child exploitation, and human smuggling. Additionally, this bill provides necessary funding to allow the Coast Guard to continue to invest in critical programs like the offshore patrol cutter and to acquire a commercially available icebreaker that will expand our near-term presence in the Arctic to counter the ambitions of Russia and China. I remain thankful to Senator Murphy for working with me to secure these critical priorities. While I have no doubt this bill makes significant strides compared to President Biden's woeful budget request, there is still more work that needs to be done to end rather than manage the ongoing border crisis. On the hills of record encounters, I believe that we must complement the border security technology included in this bill with funding for a physical barrier system along our southern border. After several visits of the southern border, it is something that I personally believe is a critical tool to helping keep our homeland safe and secure. Despite this administration admitting it urgently needs additional 6,000 beds, this bill does not increase the number of ICE detention beds. And as we all know, there are billions of dollars that are flowing to different groups, DHS, non-governmental organizations included, to house migrants and move them around the country. And we need answers as to how and why and where, um, where this money is being spent. As I watch daily encounters continue to increase um, day after day, yesterday, 6,883, I remain concerned that these issues I just referenced serve as an incentive for people to come here outside the legal pathways. I certainly remain grateful to Chairman Murphy and Chair Murray and Vice Chair Collins um, as you have worked to restore regular order here on the appropriations to the appropriations process. And I'd like to echo Chairman Murphy in thanking the Homeland Security team. On both sides of the aisle, Viraj, Daniel, Chris, Thompson, LaShonda, Cami, Jen, Jem, Emily, Chris, Maria, all of you for your hard work. As someone who has sat in a very similar seat, I know that we would not be here on any of these bills without you. So thank you for your critical work. Um, Madam Chair, um, that concludes my statement.